The first part of photosynthesis is the light reaction, whose purpose is to make ATP and NADPH that we use in the Calvin cycle to actually make those sugars. In the thylakoid membranes of plants' chloroplasts, we have these amazing proteins called photosystems. They house these chlorophyll pigments, which can absorb light of various wavelengths. And there are two photosystems, but in photosystem two, chlorophyll absorbs light to excite those electrons using that light energy. These excited electrons are passed down a chain of proteins called the electron transport chain proteins. The energy of sunlight in these electrons is slowly drawn up, used to pump protons or H plus ions into that thylakoid space. When this concentration gradient is relieved through the moving out of these protons through the ATP synthase, that energy is used to create ATP. But the electron's job is not quite done. When it arrives in photosystem one, it becomes re-energized before being packaged up and shipped away in an electron carrier called NADPH for the Calvin cycle. This pathway is known as the non-cyclic electron pathway because electrons get excited and eventually leave this ETC. However, due to the non-cyclic nature, the plants have to replenish the lost electrons, and these electrons come from water. And as H2O splits into two protons and oxygen, this is where you can draw out those electrons and the reason that you need to water your plants.